Here we are with a new problem chain hanging down from the table. A chain of length L is kept on a horizontal table such that some part of it is on the table and the remaining is hanging. It's like this. The length of the chain is L, some part is on the table and other is hanging down. If coefficient of friction between chain and the table is mu, it's mu, coefficient of friction is mu. Then find the maximum length of the chain which can be hanged down without slipping the part of the chain on the table. Without slipping the part of the chain on the table, we need to find out this maximum length which can be hanged down. Suppose this length is length is x so this would be x and this remaining length would be l minus x now let we let uh, let us we suppose that mass of the chain is m chain is capital M then linear mass density linear mass density lambda would be mass per unit length M by L so mass of the chain hanging would be mass Mx it would be Mx upon L and the mass is cool this we write mass hanging and mass on table it would be length is l minus x so now now we should use second law of motion from the equilibrium for this part of chain to stay on the table we need to equal the weight of this chain to the force of friction acting on this part of chain so from equilibrium of forces equilibrium forces mass of the weight of this chain is hanging the part of chain hanging is over l it must be equal to mu g the force of friction acting on this chain it would be in opposite direction and this would be in downward direction so on calculating we find xg equals to mu lg minus mu xg take mu xg here we find xg 1 plus mu equals to mu lg cut g g here and here we found x the part hanging down is mu L over 1 plus mu. This is our answer. Thank you.